Welcome back, everybody, to Let's Play the Technomancer, Return to a Fear. As much as that would be a good title for a sequel game, this is not a sequel. After so long away from this place for an entire three episodes, it feels like. Whoop. We finally leave Ophir only to return to it. In search of information and notes. Whoop. Okay. Okay. This is... Hang on. This is what I was talking about. So, there's a guy there, right? Up, down. But then... I move side to side, and that's what switches the camera. Really? Seriously. I want to know who in the world thought this control scheme was a good idea. Whoop! Completely forgot that wasn't a punch. necessary. It, it's gonna be a thing that happens. So, uh, don't freak out. It's not that I hate you or anything. It, it's just, you know, I'm carrying too much to run. Oh, come on. Wait, I have to come back at not... Serious here. We have Lord's Copper Stout. I'll save that for uh, Andrew. Yeah, might as well recycle it. Because the one guy who could use it doesn't like us. And is dead. Actually, might as well go ahead and get rid of those. I think I pretty much equipped everybody with uh, the stuff I want. Oh, wait a minute. Eh, I might be able to give that off to, uh, to Nisha. Cadet jacket? Don't need it. Light spike jacket? Don't need it. Bulvori, yeah, I'll still keep that. And what about shoes? We all got shoes? Yes, we all have shoes. Nice. Still need more strength for the soldier health. Good to know. So, where exactly am I supposed to, uh... Oh, okay. Well, in that case, you die first. Uh, I swear, this, uh, this disruption system makes no sense. Anytime you're ready! You are useless. Look at you, just, just standing there. What in the world were you doing? Andrew has a good mindset. He's all like, Hey, you know what? I'm a Technomancer, but I only have one arm, so I can't actually uh, use any of my Technomancer powers. And, you know, because I only have one arm, I can't use any dual-wielding skills, so uh, I'm just gonna have to roll with clobbering things upside the head with a mace. But you know what? I'm kind of a badass, so I can just whack him over the head with a wrench. In the meantime, you have absolutely no powers that were crippled, and you have both of your arms. And what do you do? You just stand there. Amelia? You are the biggest disappointment in my life right now. 
I just want to make that clear. About as clear as I possibly could. Hmm. If we use this one, we might be able to go directly underneath and make a beeline. Come on, come on. Come on! These good controls. Love them. Whoop. No, you don't. Ow. Okay, I guess you do. Alright, big guy. Me and you. Ole. Magnetic armor sounds interesting. Hmm. I'm guessing most of these are... Yeah, most of them seem like regular skills. Well, in that case... Ooh, adds life regeneration? Hello, baby. We'll turn you into A. That's going to be my utility. Because shooting lightning bolts really just feels absolutely necessary. Although that said, I am kind of curious how Electrical Storm works. Let's give it a shot. <laughs> I have found something to replace my lightning bolt. Oh my god, that cooldown time. I mean, I can just spam my lightning bolts, but man, this actually has a cooldown on it. Okay, so if I were to use magnetic armor... Hmm. So I guess it's permanent then. Right. Can't open this door without another Technomancer. Ah. Are you serious right now? Hey. Hey back. I don't care about your family. Um. Crap. So. Well, I was right about this being pretty much the way I want to go. But then there's... Huh. But then there's the problem that... I'd be able to... Hmm. I guess I might have to go to the slums and sleep it off. Do I have access to uh, the time? Here. Stats, health, uh -huh. Uh -huh. journal. Uh -huh.
that's quite done. And that leads to the slums. To find a technomancer uniform, I would have to. Wait. It's kind of pointing in a area separate on its own, which is weird. So if I were to go back up here... First of all, all the guards better not have respawned. Okay, it doesn't look like they did. There's a bookmaker. Here's the end of Lurps. Enter the chapel, find the uniform. Wait a minute. Hmm. So, if what I am seeing is correct, and I really hope it is, I only get serum from big armor people? Why? Serum. 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 Uh, you know what? I'll take everything. If nothing else, I can just, you know, harvest for a scrap. Well, there's a lady who's just begging to be shot. Alright, time to test this out. Well. Yeah, get down. Really? Okay, since, uh, you're pretty much handling things the way you usually do, which is just, uh, you know, stand there and do absolutely nothing. Disruptor gun. Ooh. I will take that. I can still run, right? Yep. I wonder if metal components and uh, building material, you know, kind of mess up your running a bit. Messing up running. Add encumbrance is what I'm trying to say if I'm not absolutely incompetent at talking. Let's see, now last time 
Well, I canceled the recording. Yeah, I already went up here and, uh, oh, wow, there's an area there. Yeah, I already wound up talking to, uh, Eliza here, who's Captain. actually surprisingly on our side. Always, Lieutenant. Zap. Thought you'd look a little worse for wear, but you look good. So probably be pissed if you stole one of our rovers. I guess he didn't have much of a choice. Nope. What do you need? If you're here for help, start talking, because every second I'm around you is a bona fide hazard. And I don't want to have to steal a rover myself. Hey, you could just come in on the sand skip we have. I mean, shoot, you were one of the people who surprisingly wasn't a traitorous bastard. Go figure. And to think, you were my number one suspect all along, although I probably shouldn't be saying that. You seem kind of eerily similar. Might just be the lighting. Just powered things. Heard there have been a few changes. Thanks to your escape, yeah. Now most Technomancer officers are treated like traitors. No, no. I think and the army's barely got a small. voice now that it's under control of the ASC. Can't tell friend from enemy anymore. Everyone's watching their own back, suspicious of everyone else. Paranoia is caught like a virus. I don't know what's going on, but I am worried what it means. You know, maybe if you didn't try sending me into a death into trap, none of this would have happened. Beginning to act like the very Aurora fascists who we hate, who had their own men assassinated. Yeah. Like I said. Really? Really shouldn't have tried sending me off. Oh. Hello. Oh, I didn't see you there. Why in the world are you going for me? Yeah, nice try. Uh, Amelia. Whenever you're ready. Sweetheart, do you know how to swing a wrench? I mean, I know in the last fight you kind of tried. And it was good that you were holding your own against two people, but come on. Uh, you aren't exactly what I'm trying to hit. Amelia, again, whenever you're ready. No, that's not why I wanted. Ow. Okay. Oh, he doesn't stun too well. There is a person standing right next to you. Whatever. Oh, Amelia. You do nothing. You don't. You don't get people to attack you. You don't help out with attacking. You just stand there. Why are you even on my team? Why? Why do I... Why do I have... It? Too much. Thanks. Hmm. Right, can I open this? I can. Kick this down. And you know what? Yep. 
just go ahead and go down and beat the living crap out of everybody. Man. I'll say this much, this shield seems to help a bit. Heavy. What, you weren't going to run into your own weapon? Uh. Really? Alright, fine. Please tell me this was before I... Or, no, not before. Please tell me this was after I kicked down the ladder, right? Right? 